my name is Tori, and I would like to do a very short video about good news, uh, specifically about mass arrests. Now, we heard about mass arrests years ago from several people online, and uh, so many of us on this planet have been desperate for good news, and so we've all been, when are they going to happen? And, and But the funny thing is, is they've been happening for years, and uh, because heaven told me years ago there wasn't going to be like one specific event that changed everything. That things were going to happen gradually in, in uh, divinely selected order. And I am having a moment of clarity tonight like I haven't had in years. So I seized the opportunity and I called the Hall of Research, which is a great place to go uh, to get information from. Because I wanted to verify that all of these people that I'm accusing of raping and murdering children, I wanted to verify that I was accurate. And they said, yes. I said, I've never accused, I've never falsely accused someone uh, of rape or murder, which is good news to me. And, um, but I would like to quickly recap, because a lot of arrests have happened here in Thorn Creek, Indiana. Now there's a new Thorn Creek, that's what I call it, there's a new Thorn Creek in Indianapolis. But the Thorn Creek up here, we're in the Lakes region of northern Indiana, and we're the old Thorn Creek, because we've been around much longer than the Thorn Creek that's uh, located in Indianapolis. And it, kind of a funny story was, uh, one of the times, um, you know, because I publicly said that I was raped uh, by Mr. Obama 261 times. Well, one of the times that, because I would absolutely refuse to acknowledge him as a president, because he's not legally qualified. He was not legally elected, and he's not legally qualified to be president, and it's corporate president. We haven't had... Uh, it's been since, I think, 1871 since America has been a country. But the funny thing was that he, uh, they shot a nuclear bomb at Thorn Creek and at us, and um, that was on a Wednesday night because uh, he was so angry at me uh, for not accepting him as my boyfriend and refusing to acknowledge him as a president. He tried to basically kill everybody in Indiana, Ohio, and Michigan, <laughs> or at least our, our, neck of the, our neck of the woods. And then they found out later, well, of course, the Galactics took the bomb in, in mid-flight. But then they, the following morning, he, they tried to, they sent an, another bomb. Thursday morning, they sent a bomb to the other Thorn Creek, which is down in Indianapolis. And, you know, the Galactics, because it, the, they're not allowed to use nuclear weapons anymore of any type of magnitude. But let's go back and recap for mass arrests that I know of for sure. Now, there's probably a lot that I don't know of, and I'm not talking about people that look human. Or, or like, say, because a lot of people are bankers have been arrested and whatnot. It has nothing to do with them. The first one that I know of and participated in was uh, the arrest of the Dracos. And uh, there were 1,738 of them. I arrested 457 of them. And uh, the arrest began in May 12, and they uh, finished in September of uh, 2013. And um, there were a lot of them. There in you can just research their names. There was Gog, Magog, Mardek, Marduk, uh, Maldek, uh, Set, Il. Um, there was one that lived inside the sun. His name was Ed. That wasn't his real name. Um, and uh, also Baphomet, Satan, and Lucifer. And I'm not referring to Lucifer the light bearer, who is an ascended master on the same level as Jesus Christ, Kuan Yin, Saint Germain, El Moria, and all the other ascended masters. Actually, Jesus' real name is Sananda, but that's, an, uh, that's another, another story. But uh, Satan and Lucifer were the last, last of the two to go, and that was in September of 2013, about two and a quarter years ago. Okay, the next uh, big arrest that I participated in and played a big part of was there were, and I got the exact number today, because I knew it was 300,000, but they told me the exact number. There were 316,014. And uh, I didn't know what to call them, and I got the uh, heavens calling them non-physical reptilians from Eta Draconis. It's spelled E-T-A Draconis, another star system in the Draco uh, constellation. Uh, most of the Draco reptilians were from a star system originally called Alpha Draconis. And I remember, and then, because I remember when I was reading Satan's DNA, I think I posted that either in David Icke's forums or somewhere, and Satan came in and he goes, I am not from Bellatrix, and he was all upset about it, and I'm like, well, you live there, you know, I mean, because what people don't understand about our star systems is like, 
Well, take my life. I, I, I started in Indiana. I also lived in Illinois. I also lived in Midtown Manhattan and in uh, Southeast Florida, Greater Miami, Miami, Fort Lauderdale, a little bit in the Palm Beaches. So if you looked at that and you said, well, where are you from? And I said, well, Indiana, Illinois, New York, and Florida. And it's the same with our star systems. You know, we're from Lyra, Vegas, Sirius B, Alcyon, etc. It's basically the same thing. And, um, and they were arrested. It wasn't too long after the Dracos went out. And, okay, not considered arrests, but uh, equally as important were these non-physical entities that when I looked at them, if you've ever seen Harry Potter... When the witches were in the air and flying around, they were like these black blobs that kind of sometimes looked like mannequins or had uh, fabric or whatever shape. It was like flapping in the wind. Okay, that's what I saw when I looked at them. Heaven calls them demons. And there were 1.2 billion of them. And uh, they were, it's not considered a rest because uh, uh, there's a lot of people on this planet that know how to do this. Um, I know there's 15 of us. But we would send them into the light. And it was just like a burst. Uh, it would stun them. We would send them into the light. And it's the same moment. Father God and uh, Mother, uh, Mother God played a part in that arrest. But Father God himself would basically grab the demons. And I don't know what happened to him after that. But he took them into the light. And I don't know what happened to him. And, okay, one of the first assassin teams... Uh, hired from a star system called Bellatrix. There were 294 reptilians. Okay, they were all arrested, and that was in February uh, here in Thorn Creek, um, uh, February of this year, 2015. On the same day, there were 458 CIA agents. They were also arrested. Now, you know what? I don't remember. Did the reptilians have physical bodies? Yes. And so did the CIA agents? Yes. Okay, the CIA agents that were arrested here actually came from a military base in Mars. Uh, Mars is hollow, and it was full of military bases and whatnot. And um, to uh, move on, the third assassin team hired to come and kill us uh, was, and I just got the name of the star system they were from, because as far as I know, there are 1,271 species of reptilians in our solar system alone. And uh, most of them are benevolent. Most of them are of the light now. We've had this galactic war that's been going on for millions of years. And um, it's, uh, except for here on Earth, it's all over. The name of the star system is spelled U-X-L-A, Alxa, I think is how you pronounce it, Alxa. The Alxa Reptilians. Now, they also came from Bellatrix, but they were, uh, the 112 Alxa Reptilians was their original star system, but they moved here from Bellatrix, or they came here from Bellatrix. And also, and then the three ones that I mentioned a few days ago that were arrested here, at, right out of my home, um, they were also from Alxa. And they also came here from Bellatrix. And they're uh, the last, I think it was the last assassin team. Uh, no, let's just call it another assassin team, because some of these details are insignificant. They don't matter. Now, they came here from a star system called Beta Canceri, which is like Beta Cancer, but it has an eye on it. A lot, of, a lot of the dark side pronounces it Beta Cancer. And uh, that's where most of the Anunnaki went. The Anunnaki, who came here, uh, which you can do a lot of research on the Internet about, um, but I suggest, you know, creating an intent and connecting to the truth and going to the true sources, the true libraries where this information is kept. All you need is 51% sacred light and transport to get there. And but the 76 Beta Canceri, there were also also reptilians, and they were arrested. Uh, let's see. Oh, let's see, I can't remember. Um, let's call my spirit guides. How many? Two days ago. Thank you, Peter and Victoria. Um, you know, it's my spirit. Spirit guides are great. Uh, if you're a being of light, everyone has spirit guides and guardian angels. And so, those, and the reason I want to share this is because the next video I want to do is about a group of 819 reptilians here on Earth. And they are people that we all know. We know their names and we know who they are, but they have to have uh, assistance to appear human. They're not really human. And um, they're the next group to be arrested. I don't know when that's going to happen. But since uh, so many of us are hungry for information about mass arrests, that's why I wanted to do a quick recap of, because uh, almost all of these I've uh, 
been involved in. In fact, I think all of them I've been involved in, not all of them, were arrested by me. Like the Dracos, I only arrested 457 out of 1,738. But when I say a part of it, it means that I contributed in some way, which will be explained to you uh, by beings of much higher intelligence than me later. And thank you so much. And if you're praying to end child trafficking, Mother God's protecting you herself, and you're not going to be killed. So don't worry about it. Thank you. Have a nice Christmas. Merry, Merry Christmas.